Yeah. You told us what it is. You told us. Chemical or physical? Do you think that there's going to be any physical reactions today? No. No. Do you want me to shove a piece of ice on the table and let it melt? Yeah. It's not very exciting. Okay, so I have. Jesus Christ. Ammonia. Oh, that is good for you. It is very good for you. I have grape juice. Mmm, grape juice. And I have vinegar. Oh my god. Nature and water vinegar together. So our materials are water, grape juice, vinegar, and ammonia. Oops. How many? A M M O N I A. Are you using the water too? Yep, water too. Are you using all three of those cups? I'm using all three of these cups. And food coloring? There's no food coloring on this table. But there was a little note. Yeah, no. it wasn't filled. There was a little there was short. A cup. So am I using it? Yeah. You will next time. It's going to be on number seven. Nice observation there, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so in one cup I'm going to put some grape juice. What color is it? It's purple. It's kind of red. And I'm going to add some water to it just so that you can see the color a little bit more clearly. What color is this? Okay, in this little cup I'm going to put ammonia. Now, ammonia is super toxic is really not safe. I'm looking to see if there was any women's symbols on it, but there isn't. But it's dangerous fumes when mixed with other products. Do not mix with bleach. Do not get in your eyes, skin, or clothing. Do not breathe in the fumes. So am I going to smell this? No. Am I going to taste it? No. Am I going to touch it? No. You can waft. I can waft, but I don't really want to because ammonia smells awful. So I'm going to put some ammonia in this cup. So what color is ammonia? Clear. It's a clear liquid. And I'm going to put some vinegar in this cup. Is, it, is this a cool experiment? I guess we'll see. Whoa. Okay, so what color is my vinegar? Clear. Clear liquid. Okay, I'm going to pour my ammonia into the grape juice. What do you think is going to happen? It's going to change color. So what color did it change to? Green. Green. And that was the ammonia going into the grape juice. juice. So now I have a green liquid. Mm, tasty. Okay, and now, yeah. So you can't drink that grape juice anymore. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to drink some ammonia. Now I'm going to pour this whole solution <laughs> into the vinegar. I don't want it to overflow. Is it orange? <laughs> so now what color is it? Red, red. Back to red. It's a physical. Is that a physical or a chemical change? It's chemical. chemical. Chemical, why? Because, because, it changed color. because there's a change of color. So what happened during this reaction, I think I have an explanation. Grape juice changes color when it's combined with an alkaline substance. The solution is pink in one glass because the pH of the water is close to neutral. So there's no acidity, and there's no alkalineness. When you pour it into the glass with the ammonia, it turns green because the ammonia creates an alkaline solution. And when you pour it into the third glass, the acidic vinegar, because it's an acid, it neutralizes it and turns it back to its original color. Does 